friends. What do you want with me? Why do you want to kill me? Because you're the brother of Shan Yupai. Really? I'm what's my brother to you? Well now, we got something for you. <laughs> It's not true, they must have used it. Captain Shaw, who do you think the murderer is? I don't know. But I do know who this knife belongs to. Who's in it? Lu Tung Chung. He is the champion of the Southern Star. Be from out of town. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Uh, uh, where uh, are you going? Uh, Uncle, we've got to go out. Uh, we've got work to do. Oh, all right, deducted from my wages. Uh, hey, idiots, you two come back here. <laughs> 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 I'm running things here. Nobody makes trouble in my place. Master Lou, you really do know how to handle the tough guys with you here. None of the local rowdies. They start throwing their weight about in the sky. Oh, Madam Flower is quite right. With Master Lou, no one dares to make trouble here. <laughs> 
Master, I've asked you so many times now. Will you take me as your pupil? Please, will you? I've been practicing Kung Fu for years. You doubt it? Then let me show you. Wood carving. But at least you'll stay alive longer. Uh, Let's go up. Uh, yeah. Hey, the boss just told you he's not gonna take you, so get the hell out of here. Uh, 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 Lee Nan, why did Master Lou refuse to take you? Uh, One of these days he'll come to me and beg me to become his pupil. You're wasting your energy. He won't teach you. You can't practice by yourself, so why don't you forget it? Just forget it. I can still practice without a teacher. Yeah, sure. Yeah. 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 You didn't mean it. Every day you up oh. the old thing, practicing that you you gong fu. Uh. But look at you. You don't know a thing. One of these days you get badly uh. hurt. Uh. 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 Well, I'm only practicing. Practice? It's about time you practiced improving your wood carvings. Huh? Uh. Take this to Tong Sing In. If you're not back here in a jiffy, look for work somewhere else. Uh. Uh. Yes. Ah, oh, Missy, you're welcome. Right, Thank you, sir. Come again, come again. Uh, come on, gentlemen, please come in. Oh, great, sir. Oh, please come inside. Would you like a room or a meal? I'll take care of everything. You just go straight in. Right on, sir. Come on, boys! Ah, oh. oh, mister. Like a room or a meal? A room. Oh, yes, yes. Waiter. Uh, I'm looking for a man uh, here. Oh, yes, sir. You know where Lu Tung Chun is? Oh, I see, sir. You're a friend of Master Lu. He lives round the corner. All right. You see those two? They're his students. Glad they can take you round there. Good. Thanks a lot. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome. Yeah. It's very hard to learn a master's style. Yeah, yeah, right 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 right. so Cheers. Right. Cheers. 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 <laughs> ah. Ah. My friend, what the hell do you want? Wine. Wine? That's my wine. I know that. But it's not healthy for you to drink too much wine. Huh? Bastard, you're asking for trouble. You pie will be waiting for him at Tongyin Station anytime. Hey, 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 Lee Nan, the master wants you to come back right away. Wait a while. Mister, you've offended Master Lou. You're a dead man if you stay around here. I think you... Waiter, uh -huh. don't worry. Uh -huh. I'll take all responsibility. Uh -huh. Give me a special room. Uh, yes. <laughs> master Shaw, you're great. Can I become your pupil? I've been practicing Kung Fu for years. You doubt it? All right, I'll show you. What? 
some kung fu so why doesn't anybody take you on i think forget it we better get back to work huh. Huh? Hmm? even if he does refuse to teach huh. i'll still learn from him Improved a lot. Enough by yourself. What have you been up to? <laughs> see you in town. Not much money now, though. That's why I've come to see you. Hey, Bolin. You're like my old brother. You're welcome to stay as long as you want. Then we'll have plenty of time to practice our Kung Fu again. Chan, what kind of style have you been using? Rolling hands. I invented it myself. What's the matter? Who did this? A fellow called Xiao Yu Pai, Master. He says he's coming for you. Oh, Xiao Yu Pai, champion of the Northern Star. Uh, Tong Chun, there's only one Xiao Yu Pai I know. How did you get on the wrong side of him? I'd like to see the man. Where's he staying? He said he'd be at Tong Ying Station. presume that's right i presume you're lu tung chun that's right you've beaten up my students now you call me out what do you want you recognize this tung chun that looks just like your knife you're right the knife is mine hmm. so you do know it just what do you mean by that it's my knife i lost it must be nine months ago but where did you find it and what are you doing here i found it stuck in my brother's body he was holding this too he was here only three days ago. So you suspect I killed your brother? Isn't that obvious? You're top of the list. How do you say that? Good God! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 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 
about it. Huh? Shall you buy? That's my knife. But I didn't kill him. Then you can tell me who took your knife. I don't know. Even if I did, I'm not obliged to tell you. Listen here. If you don't tell me who stole the knife, you're responsible. And you can listen to me. You've got just three days to find the murderer. At the end of three days, you better get the hell out of this town. Hold it. Lu Tung Tung, I'm getting out of this town. But I'm taking someone. Either the killer or you. <laughs> Shao Pai, no one tells me what to do. Not even you. Oh, Master Shao! <laughs> Master Shao, <laughs> you were great! Hey, you're the first man who ever dared talk to Master Lou like that. What do you say? They take me as your pupil? Uh, I'll work hard. Huh? Hey, 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 uh, hey uh, Lee uh, Nan, I reckon that maybe you were crazy. Otherwise, why won't anyone agree to teach you? Uh, what do you mean? Uh, uh, you're the one who's crazy. Uh, uh. Tung Chun. I don't understand why you didn't send Shao packing right away. Why didn't you permit him to remain in this town? There's only room for one, boss. Brother, if anyone gives us trouble, we deal with them straight away. Brother, why do you want us to do nothing? One, two. What did you say? When I get into town, I heard them all saying that Shao had faced you down. You're scared of him. Shut up. You talk too much nonsense. Brother Wu is here. Oh, Brother Wu, one, two. Long time no see. When did you get back? It's been six months. You haven't changed one bit. Ah, no, but I've still got a rotten temper. Hey, brother, what do you say? If someone gives us trouble, and a brother ignores it, shouldn't I get mad? You're right. I've also been telling Brother Lou to throw him out of town. Hmm. He doesn't dare. Uh, I'll go. Ching Wei, bring some men along. We'll get Xiao Hu Pai. Uh, young master. Uh, You've said enough. Come on. Uh, but... One, two. You stay here. Hmm. I'm not going to stand for this. If you want to be a coward, that's your affair. Shut up. You really think Shao Yu Pai is going to do nothing? You think he's a champion for no good reason? I tell you, even with three of you, he's still far too good for you. You're just chicken. I'll make him put his money where his mouth is. Hey, why don't you let him go? <coughs> you want? Nothing else. Ah, uh, yes. Coming! <laughs> Waiter! Oh. Waiter, oh. Waiter. Oh. show your pie! Oh. Hey! You show your pie! Have you gone deaf because I'm talking to you? Mister, you've got the right man, but the wrong place. Guy shouldn't be so rude. Should be a monk and mend his ways. Hmm? 
You're tough and proud. But that doesn't scare me. You only act like a tough guy. You're on my turf now. Don't throw your weight around here. What are you to Lu Tung Chun? He's my big brother. Jayu Pai, here's some money. And here's a knife. If you get out of town right now, you can have the money as expenses. But if you stay, that would be foolish because this knife will kill you. I don't have any quarrel with you. I only want the man who murdered my brother. Hmm. I don't care who the guy is, but you've been giving us too much trouble. So I am going to say that you leave town. You'll make me. Hmm. You'd better think again. <laughs> Now watch closely, because I want to follow his star. go around killing people. If you don't kill me now, you'll live to regret it. Go back and tell your brother that in three days, if he can't tell me who's the thief, then I'm taking him into the police. <laughs> brother, you've got to do something to him. You can't just let him insult you. What's stopping you from going after him now? Pancho, I've already told you not to interfere. I'll handle this business myself. Brother! You say Xiao Yu Pai was already in town? Yes. He got into town at noon. And he's already had a fight with Lu. Master, this looks like our chance. <laughs> That's good. The warlord has given me special orders. He wants us to take control of the town. And we got one week before he sends the troops over. So now, we better plan our next move. Somehow we're gonna make Lou and Xiao Yu Pai kill each other. <laughs> Come again! All right. All right. All right. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> bye, -bye. <laughs>
Hey, look at you. Hey, is that your best? I'll teach you. Ah, uh, you teach me? Hey, you asked me to watch his technique. Uh, uh, some of them I remember quite well. Uh, now you watch this. Uh, 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 you see my fist? Uh, you should uh, strike upwards first. Uh, 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 preserve your strength uh, and then you pull it back. Uh, oh, 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 I, I remember. Hey, hey, now watch this. Uh, you see this kick? It's like the fist. Strike up. See how it goes. Oh! You! You really remember all of his moves? Of course I remember. Every detail is frankly printed in my brain, but I did add one or two movements myself. You! I'm warning you. Next time when I'm practicing, you better be quiet. Otherwise, I'll break both your legs. Now get out of my life! Oh, nothing ever seems to work for me. I don't know if we can make it. Maybe we can take some of the other guys over yeah, there. Right. Right. Oh, Linan! Hey, hey, Linan! I've just seen two strangers following Master Lou's students. Look like they're up to no good. Huh? Really? Yeah. Let's go take a look. Yeah. Oh, all right. Will you take me there with you tomorrow? Yeah, of course, of course. I don't mind. Oh, I like it very much. <laughs> My friend, I don't know who you are. Why do you want to kill me? <laughs> There's no need for you to know the reason. <laughs> might have joined in. Never leave any witness alive. Number three, inform number two. Tell them to find out where the kid's living. Yes, sir. Master! Master! Master, two of our men have been killed. Who oh, would dare to kill them? I asked already, but no one knows. Bury that body. Send our men to find out. Somebody must know something. Yes, sir. Brother, it's very obvious. It must have been Sherry Pie. We can't say that until we got some evidence. We can't? But we know he's not on our side. We know he's threatened you. And he's insulting you. Without you doing a thing. Now he kills your students. You still defend him. I think the real reason is you're afraid of him. You! <laughs> 
Tung Chun. It won't harm us to ask Xiao Yu Pai a few questions. All right. Master Lu, we haven't opened up yet for business. Why shall you pass then? Uh, room uh, three. Brother. Lu Tung Chun, have you found the thief yet? Shall you pass, don't play games with me. Did you kill two of my students last night? What's that? I was in my room last night. I never left there. <laughs> Is what he's saying the truth? Uh, it's true. Tung Chun. So he was here. He sent men instead. Lu Tung Chun, if he opens his mouth once more, I'll cut out his tongue for him. You, Chao Yu Pai. How many men you break the town? <laughs> I don't have to answer you. You must for it. Kill your students. And how do you know? Because I was there. I had a fight with them too last night. Who do you mean? Uh, I don't know them. I've never seen them before. One of them had a scar on his neck, and the other one he had a beard, but that's all I noticed. Shall you buy? I don't care whether these two men are in your pay or not. Before tomorrow sundown, you better get your ass out of town. <laughs> Otherwise, you're leaving in a coffin. Unless I find the killer. I'm staying. I'm not going to leave here without him. I'll say it again. If you stay, I'm going to kill you. And I'll say it again. I'm staying put unless I leave here with my brother's murderer. Uh, uh, Master Lu. Uh, oh. <laughs> Master Shaw. Tell me, was the scar on the man's neck made recently? Uh, yeah, yeah. If you see him again, would you know him? <laughs> Depends on whether or not you'll teach me Kung Fu. <laughs> <laughs> Straight pillar. Straight pillar? <laughs> Away. <laughs> Lean in. You can't learn if you're too scared. Uh, I didn't mean I was scared. It's only that. I see. You're for real. <laughs> of course not. Only testing you. Yeah? I'm sure I'm going to find a use for what you taught. And since I'm a businessman, I need to make stock inventory. Hmm. I hope I come across this guy with a scar on his neck. If you're lying to me, I'll break your arms as well as your legs. Ah, oh, that's easy. Even if he's dead, I'll recognize him. Good. Now you can show me if you like what I've taught you so oh. far. You won't beat my master. So how can I be expected to learn your kung fu? 
You're right. I think Fourth Brother should lie low. Otherwise, he might ruin everything. Hey, what do I have to hide for? I can handle them any time. <laughs> I don't reckon these so-called champions are a match for me. Shut up. If they weren't very good, you think I'd still be here sweating out a plan? Unless they can be tricked into fighting. Wayne well, Maslow kiss his time to buy right now. Remember, we just got a week. Johnny Pie's got to go, too. Why don't you deal with them? You're more than a match for them. If I should fight it myself, the people will be against me. Then nobody will want to work for us when the warlock gets here. Master, what do you suggest we should do now? We'll get rid of that woodcarver. Let's pound a set Shao and Lou at each other. Brother, I think we better use Madame Flower to help us on this one. Madame Flower? Isn't she Lu Ting Chun's mistress? She's an extremely smart lady, and she follows the money. Number three, I'll put you in charge of it. Master, you know Xiao Yupai is against you, so why don't you get rid of him? <laughs> if he was as easy to deal with as that, then he'd never have been Northern Champion. Oh, there. Master, it's me! Master, Li Nan's spending his time with Xiao. Madam Flower, mm -hmm. are you saying Li Nan's teamed up with Xiao Yupai so he can get at me? <laughs> He wouldn't dare fight you himself. Mm. I hope you're right. I'll have a talk to him. You can go back now. Uh, uh, someone help! Uh, oh, 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 you can't come in here. Uh, oh, oh, Madame Flower's still sleeping. Oh. Hold it! Oh. Who are you? How dare you come here making trouble? Are you Madame Flower? Yes. Who else do you think I was? You better show me some respect. <laughs> what about this? That make it better? If you think you can buy me with that much, you must be dreaming. If you want a girl, you come back later. Madam Flower, I realize you may not fancy me much, but what about my boss, Chu Pao Tin? You interested in him? Ah, so you're working for Mr. Chu. <laughs> Please excuse me. Here, sit down. Serve the gentleman tea. Yeah, right away. <laughs> Master Chu is very well known at Wai Pai City. <laughs> Here's your tea. <laughs> Which is where I first met your master. He looked after me. <laughs> he was most generous. I have remained loyal ever since to him. I'll never let him down. <laughs> so what do you want? You just tell me. I never expected you to be so helpful. <laughs> Take Lee Nan outside and kill him. <gasps> Master Lu would never forgive me if he knows. You'll ruin my business. You'll have my house closed down. <laughs> but if you don't do what our master tells you, then you'll be dead. <laughs> Uh, Master Lu. Uh, uh, Lee Nan, uh, where have you been all this time? Master Lu's been waiting all day for you to show up. <laughs> Lee Nan, I know you spent yesterday with Xiao Yu Pai. Uh, you're right. We did a good deal together yesterday. Oh, what did you do? Uh, well, I recognize a killer for him, and he taught me three new styles. Let me show you. <laughs> I'll ask again. You yes, better talk. Yes. If you lie, I'll snap your neck like a cornstalk. Yes. Have you ever met Xiao Yu Pai before? Uh, I haven't. Did Xiao Yu Pai kill any of my students? Yes. Oh, no, no, Did no. Did he or didn't he? It was two strangers who murdered them. Right. Now listen carefully. If you do see those strangers again, tell me immediately. Uh, Otherwise, you could easily end up a cripple. You understand? Uh, yes. 
what will you pay me? Are you blackmailing me? How do you know my kung fu? Sorry, when you refuse to teach, then I started to watch you. <laughs> Master Lu, I'm a businessman, so I'll trade you some information if you teach me three of your fighting styles. Dragon attack! The Toad Dragons! Three flowers! Lean on. If you're lying to me, I'll chop up both your hands. Yes. Master Lou, do come again. See you soon, if you have the time. You son of a bitch. You want to get killed? How dare you talk to Master Lou like that? Oh, my time has come at last. This is important for me. Uncle, I've been learning kicks and punches. The two dragons. You're always floating about. Manager. Ah, oh, Madam Flower, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Oh, oh. Uh, I, I, what is wrong with you? Oh, oh, uh, uh, what can I do for you? Uh, my relative wants two Buddha figures. Uh, Will you send it over to Chen Village? It's for the elder. Sure. <laughs> Li Nan, uh, think you could take it for me? Oh, no problem. Right away, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> Can I pass? Ah, it's you again. You bastard. You won't get away this time. <laughs> Uh, if you want to shut me up, huh, won't be as easy as you think. <laughs> Lord, but uh, forgive me, <laughs> forgive me. Thank <laughs> you. 
Nice to hear wine, Jay. Waiter, bring me some tea. Oh, right away. Come on, Jay. Uh, Master Shaw. What's been going on? Those guys try to kill me. You mean the man with the scar on his neck? That's right. He's Chow Ho. He's with two more men. They were waiting for me in an ambush to kill me. But what were you doing over there? You know, Madame Flower, she asked me. She had a delivery. Hmm. I think somehow she's involved. I'll have a talk with her. H hold it. She's Lu Tung Chung's mistress. I don't care if Lu's her protector. I'll tear that brothel apart. Oh, damn it. I better tell Master Lu. Some new customers, girls! Come now, girls. You know what you've got to do. See, they're well satisfied. <laughs> uh, mister, take your time. <laughs> ah, uh, Mister, you're welcome here. Is there any girl you like? Not one. I just want to see your boss. Madam Flower. Uh, mister, you gotta be kidding. The madam stopped working some time ago. Uh, if you don't mind, I'll fix you up with a much prettier and younger girl. <laughs> oh. Where's Madam Flower? Uh, 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 Madam Flower uh, is there. <laughs> yes, gentlemen. You're always welcome. Your pleasure is my business. Where are you can serve our guests? <laughs> are you Madam Flower? <laughs> That's right, mister. I guess you must be from out of town. Mm, I hope you will enjoy your visit here. Madam Flower, don't come to schoolgirl with me. Surely you know who I am. Ah, mister, you have got to be joking. I've never ever seen you before, so how should I know who you are? Hmm. I'm Xiao Yu Pai. Ah, so you must be the fellow who had that big fight with Mr. Li Tung Chun. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you. Madam Flower, stop beating about the bush. Talk! Where the hell's Chow Hu? Ah, mister. Every day we get so many customers in here. How should I know Chow Hu? You sent Li Nan on the delivery. But Chow Hu was waiting for him in ambush. Do you deny it? Mister, you're welcome to try any of our girls you fancy. Go ahead. But if you want some information, excuse me, then I have no time. Madam Flower, you have two minutes to think it over. If you don't tell me where I can find Chow Hu, then I'll rip this place apart. Sorry, you Pai. I'm here now. Nobody's gonna touch a single brick while I'm around. <laughs> Master, why don't you decide? He keeps insisting I know someone called Chow Hu, but I can't remember that customer. Ah, uh, Madam Flower, you sent me on a delivery yesterday, but Chow Hu knew about it, because he and his men ambushed me. Ah, uh, Master Lu, Chow Hu's the man who murdered your students. Minan? What are such nonsense? There's no quarrel between us. So why should I have you killed? Madam Flower, did you ask him to make a delivery yesterday? It's true. Two bit of figures for a relative. I asked Lee to take them. What's wrong about that? Madam Flower, you're not talking to three-year-old children. Stop lying to us. You listen. If there's a guy called Chow Hu, it's none of your business. <laughs> Lu Tung Chun, when my brother was murdered, he died clutching a gold necklace. I doubt somehow that it belonged to Chow Hu. So, if I am right, it means that your brother is innocent. Nonsense. My brother didn't kill him. He doesn't need you to prove he's not guilty. I'm telling you, if what Li Nan said is true, and Chow Wu is the one who killed your brother and your students, then you can leave him to us. Hmm. And what if I should interfere? I'll kill you as well! <laughs> Get back. Shall you buy? Whatever happens, if you don't leave here right this minute, hmm. one of us is gonna be dead. Lu Tung Chun, you should understand. You can't kill me anyway. Shall you buy? Hmm. I know you're experienced, but you ought to understand that in Tung Chung Town, I am the king. And you are only a subject. <laughs> <laughs> But a subject can rise up against the king. You've got a big mouth. <laughs> Big <laughs> 
Good. Not bad at all. <laughs> Lu Tung Chun, I meant what I said to you. Unless I want to, nobody can force me to leave town. Sorry, Pai. I'll keep my word to you. If you stay, <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Madam Flair, I'll be back here again. <laughs> hey, Mr. Chow, wait for me! Hey, wait for me! Madam Flower, where is he? He? Which he? Chao Ho. Uh, master, don't tell me you believe all those lies. Madam Flower, he should understand. No one ever cheats me. <laughs> and gets away with it to tell the story. Master Shaw, I really think you'd better leave town. There are so many of them, and in any case, you will... Don't worry, he won't kill me. But you must help me find out who the real killer is. Oh, of course. But Master Shaw, if you don't mind, will you still teach me? I promise I won't ask again. All right. But you better show me how much you've learned so far. Right. <laughs> This is the right place. Of course I'm sure. Second master wants to see us. Oh, you know what it's all about. Brother, what do you want us to do next? I set a trap for him. I'll see Lu Wan Chung come to the forest. You guys wait for him there. Listen, we can't afford to fail this time. The boss said to be careful. Don't expose your real identity. I understand. All right, you can go. Mm. What do you mean? They're gonna ambush Lu Wan Chun in the forest and kill him? That's right. But the guy in charge never turned his face so I couldn't see. This time, maybe I'll find out who's the man behind all this. Come on. Brother Wu, did you really get Xiao Pai Yu to meet you here alone? Hmm. Yes, your brother's too afraid of him. But I can't stand the proud bastard. Do you think we can get rid of him? After all, he's only one man alone. We can easily ambush him. When he does show, we will attack him suddenly. He won't know what hit him. I don't reckon he stands a chance against us. What do you want? You better say your prayers, because you are going to die. Wan Chun, no point talking. Let's fight. You. I thought you sent us here to get rid of them. Ah! 
Johnson. I don't reckon there's any point talking to you. Shall you Don't you stop playing cover with me. I know all your games, so don't push it. <laughs> Master Shaw, you mustn't kill him. Lu Wenchun, if I want to kill you, I'll be doing everybody a favor. That's right. Go back and tell your brother. When I find the truth, I'll be calling on him. Uh, huh? You say that Shaw Yubai saved you? That's right. Tung Chun, we better be careful. I reckon this is some kind of trick set up by Shao. This whole affair is so strange. I don't get it. If Shao wasn't trying to kill Wan Chun, then who the hell else could it be? Hmm. Don't worry. Just as soon as Shao Yupai leaves town, it's my guess, and all your worries will be over. Hello. Hi. What's wrong? What are you doing here all by yourself? Oh! Lee <laughs> Nan, nobody can overhear us, so tell me the truth. You and Shao Pai, how'd you know someone tried to kill my brother? Uh, Master Lu, it was just by chance. I heard some noise in the woods. Oh? Who's that, boss? Uh, I couldn't see his face, but I'll tell you one thing. It wasn't Master Shao. Oh. Who else could it be? <laughs> What's that? Lu Tung Chung suspects something. It's true. He met with Lee and asked for some more facts. Master, we mustn't wait. We've got to make our move now. Master, number two is right. I think we should move tonight. With any luck, we'll get rid of him. Brother, take it easy. Still got men and flowers a trump card. Hmm? <laughs> So you're sure it wasn't Master Lu who murdered your brother? As soon as I heard the man had a scar, everything became clear. Master Shaw, Madam Flower sent this letter over to you. Thank you. You're welcome. If you want to know who killed your brother, then meet me on the other side of town. Madam Flower. Master Shao, I think it's a trap. After all, Madame Flower is Lou's mistress. Why should she tell you about it? Why not tell Lou? So it is a trap. I still must go. At last, I'll find out one way or the other. Around. Are you all working for Madame Flower? Sorry, you pie. We've been hired by Lu Tung Chung. He sent us to kill you. Get it! I don't want to kill you all. So you report back to Lu Tung Chun. If he wants me, he can come and face me personally instead of squandering the lives of his men. Sorry, you pie. Actually, I respect you. You're tough and brave. You're a good man. So don't make men like you anymore. <laughs> but you've offended Master Lou. Otherwise, I'd be glad to be your friend. Anyway, now you're gonna die. It won't be as easy as that. Yeah, I'm tired. 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 I'm tired
Southern style. Northern style. in a little pieces. Uh, 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 now, uh, uh, It's Lutung Chuno to me. Nonsense. Who are you really working for? Uh, Tao. It's Madam Flower. Let's go see Madame Flower. Right. Wait up! He's been killed! <laughs> ah. oh. Mr. Shaw! Madame Flower! Who did this to you? Chief Party! Where is he? Tung Chum, they're all in this together. You mustn't listen to them. You? Chow Yu Pai, I told you. If you stay, I'd kill you. Time. Why do you wait until now? Right. Lutington, I'll be leaving soon. Tomorrow at sundown. I'll be taking the killer with me. <laughs> I hope it's not you.
Master, before Madame Flower died, she did mention your name. So I figure Xiao Yu Pai will be coming around here soon. Don't you think we should do something? Brother, why are you so afraid of them? We're more than a match for that lot. Brother, don't be so sure. Xiao Yu Pai, Lu Tong Chun, of all tough guys, we don't stand a chance against them. Mm. Brother, you better try to get Lu Tong Chun to Ching Shan Po. And you deal with him there. I'll be at Cheng Yu Hill to meet Xiao Yu Pai. Master Xiao, they're real tricky. You shouldn't meet them there alone. I must find the killer, so I must take risks. I have to go to meet them. If you insist, then I'm coming too. Can't let you go alone. You don't have to come with me. You'd be wiser to go back to your wood carving. Ah, <laughs> you're wrong about that. I've learned a lot. I've been watching your kung fu. <laughs> so really, I suppose I should call you master. And I should make sure that you're protected. So you see, I've got to come with you. So you still want to learn? Oh, yes. Then don't ever follow me again. If you do, then I'll never teach you. Uh, hey, uh, you... Wu Lin, you sure about this? Shall you pay arrange to meet Chu Pa Tin here? Yes, I'm sure. The friends who told me are 100% reliable. Brother, they're the ones who tried to kill me. Oh, are you working for Chu Pa Tin? You're right. The boss told us to get rid of you. <laughs> Who you are, so why are you trying to fight me? <laughs> Shall you pie? I'm Chu Patin. I'm the one you're looking for. So you sent men to kill my brother? That's right. Why did you? He never did anything to you. But he's your brother. Shall you pie? Remember a year ago at Wu Li, you caught my two brothers. Right. <laughs> Chu Shang, I get my man. And I never fail. Chao Pai, you're no longer with the police. So why make it your business? I had my duty. I knew the Ming Yang gang had robbed eight banks. I figured it was about time you were behind bars. <laughs> <laughs> So you handed them over to the cops, and they were executed. Now it's my turn, <laughs> and I'm going to see you die real slow. They robbed many banks and murdered innocent people. They deserve to die. Chu Pa Tin, if all you want is your revenge, why did you drag Lu Tung Chung into this? Because Wall on Wang wanted me. We need to control here. For that reason, we try to get you to kill each other. Hmm. So you're really working for the warlord. Unfortunately, your pen's gonna fail. <laughs> now we've got you here. You'll only leave dead. You die! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Watch out! Watch out! You! Lu Jun, don't be surprised. He's our inside man. He's always worked for us. He stole your knife from you. And he gave it to us. Lu Tung Chun, when you're dead, I'll be the new leader of this town. Brother! Watch out! You all! Martin. That's right, Lu Tung Chung. I must say I didn't expect you to escape from my men. 
He's the one behind your brother's death. And then he tried to set us up so we'd kill each other. He's also responsible for killing your brother. Two part ten. You better say your prayers today you're gonna die. Lil Tung Chung, you're the one who's gonna die. <laughs> Are you feeling all right? I, uh, I'm dying. If you want to help me back to life, that's easy. Take me on as your student. Oh. Uh. <laughs> 